Okay, so we made the the, the uh, walnut milk. Which is delicious, <laughs> and it's it's pretty too. <laughs> <laughs> it is, and it's it, stark white. And it goes great on the granola. Mm -hmm. There's other purposes for it too. Um, I've made it into ice cream, but what I want to show you next oh, is that would make a really good ice. It's cream. a really rich, mm. lovely ice cream. Yes. Um, and what we're going to do is, I'd like to make a smoothie out okay. of it. So sometimes when we make smoothies, we use a, a juice base, or we might use a coconut water mm -hmm. as a base. That's lovely. But a more satisfying smoothie is one that uses nut milk as okay. a base. And so... And this will be one smoothie that I like, because I don't like regular dairy milk. So. And you will like this, and, it's, and it comes off like a milkshake. So what we're going to do is we're going to be... I'm just going to put a little bit of milk in here. We're going to make a small smoothie. We don't have to necessarily do the entire... Okay. Thing. Um, I'm going to, I have some frozen banana and this is simply banana. You can tell that this banana was very, very ripe mm -hmm. when I put it in the freezer. It, the outside of it was black, much like what, if you were baking banana bread. Yes. I peel it, put it in the freezer, let it get hard and firm, and then... Um, That's and, gonna have lots of sweetness. Exactly. And a real strong banana flavor. That's r exactly right. And the reason that um, we're doing that is to avoid having to add artificial sweetener. So the sweet banana is gonna go in there. And, he, and the banana's frozen, and the milk obviously is not. Um, so we're gonna be, at, that'll give us a little bit of bulk. And the other thing I'm gonna be adding are some strawberries. Now the strawberries you'll also see are frozen. frozen. They could certainly be fresh, but I had frozen strawberries. They were on sale, they were organic. Um, I threw them in the freezer, and you can see you still have the stems on. Uh -huh. We're going to still use the stem, aren't we? That's right. right, exactly. So I'm just going to take a few out of here and um, and put them in. We're going to be making just a typical uh, banana strawberry um, smoothie. But now I'm going to add something else that might okay. surprise you. See sweet that potato? <laughs> <laughs> sweet potato? No, right. not in this recipe. <laughs> right there on that plate. I'm oh, the green! Yes. Okay. We're gonna make the a stems green. on the strawberry wasn't enough. No, right? no, no. We're gonna add a little bit of. I'm gonna break this off and put in some romaine. Okay. And I'm also gonna yeah, put in. Yeah, I wouldn't think to add that to my milky smoothie. No. And a little bit of kale. Um, we can always go back, as I've all, as I'm prone to saying, we can always add more. It's just Can't harder than heck out. to That's take right. it out. So now um, that we could add more vanilla, I'm gonna wait and see what it tastes like before I decide that I'm gonna do any fa okay. flavor balancing. I'm going to put the top on here. Always make sure it's on tight. Yeah, I could see where, whoa! <laughs> exactly. Like a big old mess on the ceiling. <laughs> and then we're going to turn the blender on. And you can hear those strawberries <laughs> are very firm. I was worried that the strawberries were too hard and were going to give us a fit, but it doesn't seem like mm -hmm. they have. So I'm going to go in there and, with your permission, just taste it. Okay. And then um, I'm going to see if we need to add anything. So hang on. Ooh. We good? I think we hit it the first hey, time. We yeah, like that. I'm thinking so. All right, I'm um, going to get a couple glasses. That's here. great. <clears throat> there are still some chunks, a little bit of chunk of strawberry, but okay. it's not going to hurt anybody. Um, so you can see those. Oh yeah. <laughs> but that's all right. Because we can eat the rest of that with a spoon. Mmm. Okay. Now. I just, everything is so, I've said it a hundred times today, but it's so pretty. I mean, it is. It's just, you know, even the speckles with the strawberry and uh -huh. the, the green leafy things in there, it's very pretty. And it's not ridiculously green. That's the other thing. No. If you've got a child who, who is adverse to greens, and many of them are, you can sneak that in there. If they didn't see you do it, they wouldn't know. No. Um, Obviously, you're not going to put in a whole bunch of kale if you're trying to, you know, pull a fast one on your little one. But if you and if you wanted to add more, you could do something with blueberries or something that would oh, would mm -hmm. disguise the green taste. So, should we try it? Yes. Cheers again. Yeah, thank you. That's like a milkshake. <laughs> And I don't usually have a milkshake, but it's a very, ooh, I love it. It's a banana mm -hmm. strawberry. We could add um, some chocolate powder if you wanted to ooh, do that. Ooh, that would be good in there, mm -hmm. too. Banana chocolate strawberry would be a nice thing. Um, you could put in any kind of other, like, other extracts. You could add more vanilla. You can do any number of things. Now, would you serve this as a dessert? Could it, would this be, mm. could this replace a meal? I would do this as a meal replacement. Meal replacement? Mm -hmm. Because it's, it's high in calorie um, because of the nut milk. Not high in calorie, but higher in calorie, mm -hmm. um, certainly than 
than a juice might be. Um, and it's satisfying. So if you drank this entire, the two glasses together, that would be a meal to me. It would be your lunch or whatever. Oh, this is good. Mm -hmm. But it is good enough to be a dessert or it is good enough to be something that you have when you have a sweet craving. Mm -hmm. I'm going to want to meet with you twice a week. <laughs> <laughs> Thank Done you. Deal. Thank Absolutely. You. Yeah, you oh, bet. Everything was wonderful. Good. Well, ne next time we'll do the dehydrating thing. Okay. I'll show you all kinds of uh, wonderful tricks. Um, Maybe we'll learn wait. how to make granola. We'll we'll figure out. I what... can't wait. Yeah. Because like, you have your stoves all covered up, and it's, you got <laughs> stuff stored in the oven, and you have to use it. So I'm anxious to see kind of how. Because I was like, you make muffin. Oh, you do all of it in the dehydrator. Dehydrator. So I, I can't wait to learn more about that. Exactly. Mm. This was good. Maddie would like this. Good. And John. Well, thank you for having me. Mm. I, this has been a joy. Remember to kidding? drink your water. I, uh, yes, I will. And you've given me some ways to liven up my water. So <laughs> even better. Go I ahead. will do, I will do. What was it by a side? Do I have an assignment? I just juice for the next week, right? You juice for the next week, and I'll send you some things via email, okay. some, some assignments as well. All right. Okay, sounds good. All Ooh, right. This is the most fun assignments I have ever had in my life. <laughs> good, good. <laughs>